we're gonna use the remaining bunch of coriander as a garnish look at that beautiful hi welcome back to my channel today I'm gonna show you how I make my Mediterranean fasoya or bean stew this dish is super easy super healthy and super yummy and I'm sure your whole family will love to start off with let's talk about the beans today I'm using lima beans they are also known as butter beans like many other beans they are a good source of fiber so for about four cups of lima beans I will be adding about six cups of water I'll be soaking these beans to about 12 to 24 hours and I'll just cover these with some glad wrap and leave it overnight on the kitchen bench tub After six hours, the beans would look like these. I'll add another two cups of water and definitely cover again with some batter up and check again by the next six to 12 hours. So I've soaked my beans for about 24 hours and look at those. The beans as clearly double its size. I can't wait to cook them. But before that, let's quickly go over our ingredients. I am using a large brown onion, two heads of garlic. I'm also going to be adding some Arabic spices. Now, please do not skip this ingredient. I'll be adding a tablespoon, but if you're unsure about the taste, you can add just half a tablespoon. Also, one of my favorite herbs, I'll be adding two bunches of coriander, one when I'm cooking this stew, and one bunch just use for garnishing and of course I'll be using four cans of tomatoes and a tub or 150 grams of tomato paste now to a large pot with extra virgin olive oil let's add the brown onions cook the onions for about a minute or two then add the beans now cook the beans after you rinse it properly or thoroughly it is very important that you rinse the beans thoroughly now you don't want to cook the water with the beans that will soak overnight Okay, so just letting you know that you have to cook these beans with clear water. Simply add the tomatoes. in goes the seven spices about a tablespoon and then followed by a tiny oh, spoon of tomato paste or about 140 grams I think yeah and mix. just mix
our bean stew is bubbling away. So at this time we're going to be adding four large vegetable cubes or you can also use beef cubes if you like. So I just bought these at my local grocery shop. You can use any brand. So our bean stew is bubbling away. Let's add some salt and pepper to taste. At this time, just put the heat on low. And let it simmer for about an hour to an hour and a half until the beans taste and feels like butter. It just melts in your mouth. Okay, so just let it simmer and then wait and come back to it. And then we put the fermenta as a garnish in the end to have a beautiful aroma. So, an hour and a half and the stew is looking so beautiful look at that as you can see the sauce has reduced dramatically so with this type of stew, you have to keep tasting until you reach your desired flavor. Just to balance the acidity. So to this recipe, I'll put about a teaspoon of sugar. And I'll have to taste it as well. And also probably half a lemon or maybe a quarter cup of lemon. I'll put that in and I'll just have to taste and keep tasting until I'll reach my desired flavor. So let's try and taste. Ooh, wow, that's beautiful. Look at that. All the beans. So let's taste a little bit of the sauce and see. Mm. I think that's perfect. Okay, for me, the dish, this is ready. Now we're just going to quickly put in our coriander or a bunch of coriander just right there. Just when you're about to finish. Okay. If you can only smell the aroma of coriander. Hmm. Look at a beautiful bean stew. Look at that. Let's have some beans. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Please try this recipe. Please guys, try this recipe at home. Mm. Mm -hmm. I 
absolutely delicious. Wow. Okay guys, I have to finish my dinner. I hope you enjoyed this video and please send me a message if you like this video. Please click subscribe if you haven't done it yet. And I have to go. I have to finish my dinner. This is so yummy. Please try this at home. You will not regret it. I'm sure your family will love it. Thanks so much again for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye for now. So what do you think? Say yummy, mommy. Delicious. Take a